Hi there, so in this video I'm going to show you how to get environment variables on your Windows system using Go programming language. So first thing, make sure you have text editor or ID within which you can create Go language files. So for example, I have Visual Studio Code in which I have created this sample .go file. Now, open your that file and type in package main this will import main package so that you can create your program and with that you will create main function with keyword func f u n c and then main and inside this we are going to create one variable named env now colon equals to sys call dot and here we are going to use environ as function so this function will get system environment completely and from that we have to extract one environment variable at a time okay you also check the top here syscall is imported as package so it will have that call automatically if you have id such as visual studio code that can allow you to do this otherwise you have to manually type this in okay now we will have for loop to iterate through our system variables so let's create one variable make it check the range of env and inside that we will simply use format println and then we will use one variable at a time from our system and environment variables and it will print that one line at a time on console now save this and you will find that format package also gets added in this import statement okay so let's open this terminal and go to the directory where you have this file stored now I want you to type in this command go then run and then name of your go file which is in my case sample.go and you can see that there are plenty of system variables here it starts with my user directory then it shows me all the other path within so class path google api then this mos plugin etc etc so it goes all the way down to the log file listed here so that being said you can see that it is fetching all the environment variables from my system account so this was a short video on how to get system environment variables from your windows machine and print them one line at a time on console